coworker had a really interesting graphical issue today. A bunch of lines were showing through his model. So I did some exploration. We figured out what the problem was. There's actually a really easy fix. The eye elevation and target elevation, if they're a really large number, this is when you're going to start having these issues. And generally when something in Revit is super far away, you might have some graphical issues. So unfortunately you can't just type in zero and accept that because as soon as you start rotating, it's going to maintain a really large number. So what you need to do is come up here and click on the corner of the view cube and that should resolve your problem. Now let's say you have a view that is significantly further away than it needs to be and your graphics are absolutely outrageous. What I would do is I would select certain elements, isolate the elements that are inside your view, and this will hide out anything else that's on the outside, and then you can type in ZE for zoom extents. It'll zoom it into this location and then you can click this button on the view cube. Try that again, grab everything, ZE, and pick a different one, and there you go. So sometimes you've got to readjust, get it to re-zoom into what it's looking at. Uh, zoom Extents actually does a really interesting thing where it reloads the graphics relevant to the scale and the size of the view, uh, the size of the information that it's showing. So if you have a bunch of elements that are really far apart and you zoom extents and it grabs all of this information from the outside, it's going to be drawing things like circles with less geometry than it is if it's going to be zoomed right in on it. So that's why zooming in to the actual elements, getting it to refresh its zoom rate and then clicking on these corners of the view cube, uh, get it to reset some of its parameters that it's using to visualize the information in your scene. I can come down here and hit reset and temporary hide and we're back to how we were. My name is Jesse. I'm a practicing BIM manager teaching you Revit for free. Please subscribe. Thank you.